Sports Leader 9, Alexandra Vitale. Super Bowl 48 tonight in New Jersey at MetLife Stadium. Peyton Manning last night was voted the league's MVP for the fifth time. The Broncos and Seahawks, who's going to win tonight? The rookie QB Wilson or the remarkable veteran Manning? If you're asking me, everyone around here knows I'm going with Peyton Manning, but we will see soon enough. The Super Bowl will be played outdoors in a cold weather city. Peyton Manning talks about the Seahawks' relentless defense. Like I've said all week, that they are a, they are a smart defense and they communicate well, and so uh, they do do a good job, you know, pre-snap and post-snap. Uh, you know, it's hard to make comparisons to um, other uh, teams that haven't played against these guys in the regular season. Like I said, just played them twice in the preseason, first half of both games, and you know, not sure how much weight that carries, but uh, uh, it, their in intelligence, their ability to play together and communicate. That shows up just on the game film um, uh, alone. So, you know, I certainly know that'll be, that'll carry over when you actually get to play against them. But, uh, you're playing against a smart, athletic defense. All right, remember you can see Super Bowl 48 on our sister station, WXTX Fox 54 Sports. Kickoff is set for 6.30. All right, day two of the Peach Belt Conference Tournament this afternoon. After winning earlier in the day against St. Leo, Columbus took on Roland. CSU down 2 nothing in the top of the third with the bases loaded right there. Sade Sims hits a base hit, driving home one runner, but Casey Gouge stops the next runner from scoring. Roland is up 3 nothing, but in the bottom of the third, Lindsey Defee right there with a solo home run, making it 3-1. Rollins. Then a little later, Suzanne Carney, she hits a home run to, to bring it 3-2. to two. Rollins still leading. The Tars beat the Cougars today 6-4. to four. Last night marked the final evening of contact between recruits and college coaches, and both the Auburn and Alabama coaching staffs took full advantage of every last minute they could spend with one of the top remaining uncommitted recruits in the country. Auburn High School outside linebacker Rayshon Evans was visited at his home by both staffs. The Evans family was originally scheduled to host Auburn head coach Gus Malzahn and Alabama defensive coordinator Kirby Smart. But as the two staffs continued to firm up their plans for the evening, the guest list grew. Alan Evans said Malzahn was accompanied by the entire defensive staff from Auburn. That's a look at sports. Rosalind. Very much. Alex, we're both for Not us. too cold, so I'll take it. All right, we will too. I like it. <laughs> now, Super Bowl tonight. Everyone's eyes will be on the Broncos <laughs> and the Seahawks. Yep. I I mean, this I know is what already I, called we it. everybody knows here by now. I'm going with Peyton Manning and the Broncos. She called it yesterday. Over. I did call it yesterday if you watched. So what do you guys think? Well, I read you know an article about the weather and what how they impacted mm -hmm. it. And now they're not expecting too much snow or sleet or anything, but they said that the, you know, Denver Broncos, you know, would have or the seat, which I think I don't remember which one would do better with the with, with the, the snowy cold weather, with, with the cold weather, weather, but it might be a factor. Good thing there's right. something to watch. Something <laughs> to watch. But Very after good. after you guys are done watching us, it's time to turn to our sister station, yes. WXTX Fox 54 Sports, which yes. Yeah, uh, the game will be going on probably <laughs> about two and a half minutes right now. I think. Exactly. They'll so be starting it all for kickoff. So a lot of people are going to be tuning in for that game. And, of course, it is in New Jersey. Yes. New Jersey. And a lot of... Some of my Parkinson's friends are there, and I am so jealous of them <laughs> right now. I mean, I want to be here, but I want to be there. <laughs> we'll enjoy it from the screen on this side. Right, Good right. night, everyone. Y'all enjoy it.